What's up everyone? This is Tim from Tim Plays Game here with Splatoon 2. Finally came out for the Nintendo Switch. There we go. Kind of want a character that looks somewhat like me. There we go. And kind of a fan of these pants. All right. So we got our inkling already made up. Now we're going to jump right into Oh, here we go. We're doing it now. Splatoon 2. Nice. <laughs> Straight to the point. Alright, basics. Okay, good. Alright. And I did play the uh, global test fire, so I have some idea of the controls, thankfully. I didn't get a chance to, uh, unfortunately, play the uh, play the Splatfest. Something came up I was going to do, and I apologize for that, but hey, we got, we're, we got Splatoon 2 now, so we'll have plenty of videos. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Okay. Wall. Okay, I gotta. Oh, okay, I gotta get used to jumping. In the last Splatoon game, uh, they just used uh, regular jumping. Okay, here we go. Jump. Oh. I gotta get used to jumping. That's the one thing that's gonna throw me off about this uh, game. I think with jumping it was Y in the last game, and now it's B. But you use Y or is it X? Yeah, it's X that you get the uh, map. All right. That's enough of a warm up. Let's get into the real game now. like this. I love the new Inkling design. I love how we get to customize them more now. It makes you feel like an actual unique uh, person in the game. Like an actual... Like something unique, you know? Alright. And we are now greeted by our two new hosts for Splatoon and Splatfest. Y'all know what time it is. It's off the hook, coming at you live from Inkopolis Square. Check it here. Here are the current regular battle stages. The jellies here can climb the rock walls faster than I can. What's with that? Well, those jellyfish do probably have a couple of inches on you. I don't know why they have southern accents. I'm just giving them that. <laughs> and these are the current ranked battle stages. Oh, they already have ranked? That's awesome. Nice. Look at me, I'm Marina, blah blah blah. Aha ah, ha, yes, yes, yeah, so me. Here are the league, ba they, they got league battle stages? Oh my god, they got league battle going already. The game came out, like, I kid you not, t two minutes ago. <laughs> they already have this, so we had to wait like a month to get these, uh, to get like a ranked battle. Uh, why is our producer freaking out? Read the teleprompter, Marina. Uh, let's see here. This just in, the great Zapfish has disappeared. Wait, like for eels? I feel like I've heard the story somewhere before. Yeah, this happened last time in Splatoon. There's more. Pop superstar Kelly of the Squid Sisters has gone missing. No, not Kelly. This is terrible. Do something, Marina. Uh, okay. I'll put together a search part. Whatever, I'm sure they'll turn up at some point. In other news... But shouldn't we form a search party or for something? And that's all the time we've got. Until next time. Don't get cooked. Stay off the hook. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of them. <laughs> I miss the Squid Sisters. Alright, so... 
This is Inkopolis Square. That's the Deca Tower where we can start doing Turf War, which we will be after I get through a uh, uh, single player mode. And then over here we have the shops. We get gear and weapons. But apparently they're kind of snobby, so you have to get up a few levels. Uh, there's a creepy shop back there. Yeah, apparently that's where you can go for a salmon run when it's open. And then we have the shoal, the hangout. Uh, that's where you can go and uh, do like a local battle and stuff. Huh? Who's that mysterious squid back there? It's almost like... No, she never hang out in a place like this and those clothes. Yeah, must be someone else. Alright. So, yeah, we're just gonna jump straight on in to single player mode. Because I want to get this out of the way. Truth be told, the last when I when I first started doing this channel, um, I started doing Splatoon videos, and I was already like at level 50 already. <laughs> and I just started doing turf war matches, but I never really got to single player mode until I kid you not, like part 50. Hmm. The Octarian. Well, actually, I did get to it. I just didn't. I redid it basically. The Octarians. Hey, you showed up. As soon as I saw you aimlessly wandering around the square, I knew you were the one. I'm Marie. I know you're probably a bit starstruck, but I need you to get it over it. Yes, I'm that Marie, you know, from the Squid Sisters. No clue who you are. You've never heard of me. For eel. Well, you obviously aren't very cultured. But you'll have to do. See, I've got a little thing I need some help with. By now you've heard that the great zapfish that powers Inkopolis Square is missing. Well, it's not just missing, it's been squidnapped by the Octarian Menace. How do I know this? On the surface I may just look like an absurdly talented pop star. But in truth, I'm Agent 2 of the new Squidbeak Splatoon and oh my god, who cares? Now I've been trying to keep an eye on the Octarians in my downtime, but I'm a busy girl. If only Kelly was around to lend a hand at him. I need you to get to the Zapfish, back from the Octarians, blah blah blah, copy-paste from Splatoon 1. So... Fine, I'll do it. Welcome aboard, you are now Agent 4 of the new Squid League Splatoon. Interesting fact, Splatoon, um, the original character from Splatoon, or when you're doing Splatoon 1, uh, single player mode, they called you Agent 3, so it only makes sense that you be Agent 4. I even bought you a brand new hero suit as a signing bonus. And look at that, it fits like a glove. Not bad for an old hand-me-down. I thought you said it was new. You just said it was new. <laughs> now let's get out there and tear those Octarians limb from limb, you know. Yeah, there's eight of them, we get it. Alright, entrances are invisible. Alright, cool. So, let's see. Okay, so that's probably the boss battle we need to find. Let's see. Okay, can't go there yet. I guess these are like solar panels or something. Oh, what's this? Alright, level one. Going in. All right. So this is the return of the Octarians. Okay, so basic, we get the uh, hero shot. And these guys, very easy to take out. Nice. I guess those are like fried rings or something where you can just jump through them and get a point. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it's not that easy. Okay. There we go. Oh. 
Nice. See if I can jump down there. There's some boxes I wanted to get. Yeah. I gotta try to find the, all the scrolls now. I think they're doing scrolls again. I don't know. There we go. Nice. Here we go. Yeah, these guys are really easy to take out. Can't really see having a problem with this part. This is just the basic, probably the tutorial, the second tutorial, really. Oh, and these things are always fun, the puffer fishes. Yeah, shoot with one, I think, and... Okay, we need a vault key. Let's go over here. Oh. Gotta be careful where I swim or else. Nice, okay, got my shield back. Okay, but I'm not seeing any key yet. Where is the key? Here we go. Hmm. There we go. That was interesting, guess that box was like taped up or something. Whatever, got through it. On we go. Ooh, armor. Nice. I see. Oh, dang. Okay, I think I missed a box back here. Yeah. One of these uh, plastic wrap boxes. Hey, what's this? Oh, nice. So I guess the Octarians are back now, and they stole Kali, and they stole the Zapfish or something. Who knows? And I'm kind of interested to see where the story goes from here. Probably just a copy paste from the last one. Okay. Oh. Miss. oh, nice. Ah, here we go. Yep. Don't know what that was, but looks cool. Make sure I got everything before I move on. All right, on we go. Yeah, okay, don't see anything down there. Oh. There we go. Gotta get used to these controls. I'm using the Pro Controller right now. I think the sensitivity is a little weird on it. Something down there. there go. Okay. Oh. 
What's up, bud? <laughs> There's something down here. Ooh, there it is. Scroll. Yeah, there's one in every level, just like the last one, I think. I tried to keep away from information. Uh, I wanted to be a little bit surprised by the new stuff that was coming out. Oh. Ambush. Nice. Alright. Sorry I keep messing with the headphones. bothering my ear. Oh, nice. Let's try the special, see what happens. Alright. <laughs> nice. Oh, sweet. I get another one. Try to get back, try to back up a little bit. That's all there is to it. And we are Zapfish. Got a Zapfish. Nice. Took me a little longer than I would have liked, but hey, I'm getting used to the game still. I figured this would probably be good. Help me get used to the controls. Alright, a shockwave. Struck while one young lady was performing at the recent youth folk singing. Contest doing damage to the venue. Fortunately, no one was injured. <laughs> There's Pearl. <laughs> wow, okay. Interesting. So we got some information about her. Nice. That's cool. They have little mini games in here. Alright, this is number two. Welcome to Octopia. Summer Wind Rises. So I guess this is all underground or something, yeah. Oh, there we go. These guys again. They're like little missiles. Oh, nice. And these are sponges. The more you income, the bigger they get, and you can even climb up them. I think that's... yep, that's everything here. Let's keep going. Nice. Alright, well, what do we got over here? Here we go. Nice. Nice. <laughs> what do we have here? Anything down here? No, I don't see anything. Alright. On we go. Onward. Nice. <laughs> Ooh, armor. Nice. these eggs. I call it, they call them power eggs. I don't know what they are. If they're actually eggs or... I just don't want, I don't want to think about it. <laughs> Damn it. I gotta, I gotta duck down. 
gonna get this guy. There we go. And yeah, it's all pretty tedious. Okay. Not sure if there's balloons had anything in them. I feel like if I had a charger or something, uh, probably be able to take them out easier. These things are like squeegees. Yeah, they suck up ink. They're a returning uh, thing from the last game. Oh, here's another returning thing from the last game. Little drop areas where you can drop down and get stuff. Any more of those? Nope. Just that one? Alright. I'm going to shoot you right back up. Ha, ah, nice. Sweet. All right, I think uh, didn't. I don't think I hit a dead end here. Uh, oh, here, here we go. Let's paint this wall a little bit. All right. Dang, didn't want to do that. Get up here and see what's up here. Ooh, there we go. I don't know what this thing is, but I like it. I want it. Alright, I think that is everything. Alright, onward. Alright, we got a special. Getting ready to use it. Nice. Is there still one left? Oh, Alright, another one. I think that's everything in this book. Yeah, it doesn't look like there was anything else. There we go. Let's go back down here. I think I might miss something. No, it looks like we got everything. All right. Go. Onward. Nice. Okay. It pretty much painted away from me, but if I know if I'm not quick, you got this guy. Nice. Alright. No, I'm forgetting something. I want to make sure. I want to get this sunken scroll. Looks like that's the end right there. Nice. No, I didn't get everything. I didn't get that sunken scroll. I don't know if I can go back and get it. Let's look around. I have a little bit of time. Uh, hmm. Yeah, if I had to guess, it'd probably be somewhere back there. Alright, I'll get it probably on another day and show sure something too big. Probably right under my nose, too. <laughs> yeah, whatever.
Alright, that's the first one down. Or second one down, sorry. Okay, there's this. I'm willing to guess the third one will be up here. Uh, how to get over there? Guess a uh, swim jump. Alright. Ooh. I don't know what these things are, but I like them. Even if they don't do anything. Okay, inking the tree doesn't do anything. Hmm. Where is this third one? Yeah, I was right next to it. Nope. Huh. Yeah, I bet it's over here. I like doing that. <laughs> open. Open. Okay, here's the third one. Yep. Sunset, Octo... Oh, dash and jump, okay. Octocopter. Sunset Octocopter. Okay, I'm trying to figure out the weird words they made up. <laughs> Ooh, that's fun. Oh, Octocopter. Okay, now I get it. Come on, bud. You gotta get better than that. Make sure I'm not missing anything. got rails returning. Oh, that's cool. It's you, That's what you can stand on. You don't have to swim through them. Woo! Okay. Nice. Alright, now, how do I get up there? I guess I gotta swim for it. Oh, they thought of everything. <laughs> nice. Woo. I can see doing a speed run being pretty fun. Ooh, what the heck is that? Ink pistons, okay. Oh, watch out for those. Oh wow, they'll just push you right off the edge, won't they? Come on. There we go. Ah, uh, great. How am I supposed to get up there? Oh, crud. Wow. Okay, they were not kidding about that. Nice. I think I can jump. Oh, crud. Wow. <laughs> Did I get to keep it? No, I didn't get to keep it. I'm getting that thing. I don't care what it is. I want it. I'll take the long way back, I guess. What's up, bud? There you go. You can have some. <laughs> oh, you want some too? There you go. Everybody gets a little bit. Alright. Oh, they're gonna make me work for it. <laughs> Great, I gotta jump in front of this thing. I'm literally jumping the shark here. Nice.
Oh boy. Okay, come on. Got to time it. Nice. Here we go. Okay, I see what's happening here. Ooh, okay. Uh, haven't found that uh, scroll yet. Hopefully gonna find it soon. Once I've already gone through it. Here, what do we got over here? Ooh, what's this? Alright, let's try it. Nice. That was fun. It's one of the new specials, the uh, Stingray. It's replacing, I'm, I'm guessing it's replacing the uh, Killer Whale. Which I kind of like. I, I was never really a big fan of the killer whale. Um, unless you can line up four people and get them all in one shot. That's always fun. I, was, I think I'm the most... Ooh. This guy came out of nowhere. Whoa. Where is this guy going? Yeah, I shoot you in the back of the head. What of it? Hit. Oh man, I gotta climb up. Okay, where? Do, how do I get up? Give me a way up. Okay. Again, they're making me work for it. Alright. Ooh! Ooh, that was fun. All kinds of fun. Oh god. Alright, didn't find the sunken scroll. I'll go back and find him. Yeah, if I had to guess, let's see. It's probably somewhere over there in that part that I didn't ink. I wonder if there's a way to get over there. Who cares? Alright, on to the boss battle next. Alright. And the boss battle is ready. Apparently. To the boss kettle. Where are we? We're at uh, Tentakeel Outpost. Okay. Try to make this quick. You're a fan of high places, aren't you? Agent 4, the first time you encounter an enemy, try to figure out its moves. Okay, you're just telling me a bunch of cool tips. That's always appreciated, but I don't need it. Okay, this is industrial toast into the octo oven. The octo oven. Okay. I'm sure I'll know what that is soon enough. Oh, this looks familiar. Whoa. Dun, dun, dun. I guess this is like the Octoling Darth Vader theme. <laughs> 425 degrees of pain. Okay. Oh, the Endos of Lows are deadly. 
Pretty easy. Nice. God. Donut stop, you need to keep going. Bread jokes, yay! Oh, alright. Getting serious now. Oh god, more pi these piston things. What are these things? Are they like bread or... I don't know, they just scare the heck out of me of what they were thinking when they were creating this thing. <laughs> hey, let's make an evil oven that <laughs> makes bread. Evil bread. That has weird mouths on it. And their metal siding, apparently. Okay. Final checkpoint. Oh my god. What is this now? Okay. Oh my god, okay. Work for it. There we go. You're done, buddy. Well, that was a kind, kind of a cool little boss right there. Wouldn't say challenging, but he uh, required some. Oh, and they're burnt. Ah, oh, we destroyed the oven. The evil oven that was trying to make bread, apparently. All right, get one of these things. Still don't know what these things are. Oh well. Hey, what's up, buddy? Are you happy to be out of that evil oven? I bet you are. <laughs> Alright, so that is the first part of... Oh, good work, Agent 4. I sure know how to pick them. Gotta hand it to the, Octo the Octarians. Though I didn't expect them to have fully operational Octobosses at their disposal. It was an oven. Alright, they had an oven. Alright, I'm going up against a blender and a toaster next, probably. <laughs> I think it's time to call in the big guns. Let's see here. Sheldon, can you hear me? Over. I hear you loud and clear, Marie. Over. Oh man, this is so cool. Ahem. Agent 4, I'm Sheldon from Ammo Knights, the only weapon shop in Inkopolis with over 542 million years of trusted service. Oh my god. That's right, stop by Ammo Knights in Inkopolis Square for all your weapon needs. Tell me Sheldon sent you. Marie told me everything. To think that my signature weapons can be of help to the new Squidbeak Splatoon, I am honored. But I'm afraid I just can't let you treat my vast arsenal like an all-you-can-eat buffet. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. I, ha I do have business to run, you know. So let's help each other out. I want you to help me test out some new weapons and I'm currently developing. All you have to do is use them in real-world conditions. If you do that for me, I'll be able to gather all sorts of information of amazing data. Okay. That data will help get me get the approvals I need to make retail versions of the weapons. <sighs> so what, I'm getting, like, military-grade weapons here? Nice. <laughs> and once the retail versions are out, you can use them in Turf War battles. It's a real win-win, don't you think? Oh, yeah. And... Okay, down, boy. <laughs> I think Agent 4 gets the point. Let's get back to work, Agent 4. Stay fresh. She still says stay fresh. Alright. So that is done. Oh, what's this? God, they're still using extension cords. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Enhance a fire. Let's go enhance a fire weapons, if that was a word. Okay, well, we'll go to the next area next video, but uh, right now I want to 
Enhancify, not a real word, my weapons. Let's see what we got here. Okay, we got 481, not really enough to enhancify, not a real word, anything. Probably enhance the weapon. Yeah, I'll take turns enhancing the weapon and the tank. What's this? Oh, that's cool. Okay. Yeah, definitely gonna need to enhance to find my weapons. <laughs> Alright guys, so let's see. That was... What was the name of that? Tentakill Outpost. That was Tentakill Outpost. Next time we're going for a Suction Cup Lookout. So uh, until then, thank you all for watching. This is Tim from Tim Plays Games signing off.